Hey there guys, welcome back to another episode of EVE Online with myself Luxury1. Uh, today we're going to get on with the last of these uh, military missions, so let's talk to this guy. Start conversation. Let's leave Wolf B for a bit, he's gone into hiding anyway, it seems. Maybe we taught him a lesson when you destroyed half of his fleet in that last encounter. We'll just let him show himself and then we'll deal with him once and for all. So about your current job then. Some envoys from Garun Investment Bank have approached me and asked for safe passage to a nearby location. They're afraid Wolf and his pack will go after them like some, uh, well, like some wolf pack from Ancient Legend. Huh. Anyway, pick them up from their quarters at the bookmark I'm about to give you and take them from there to their destination. Okay, so where are we going? Fly to the hotel your agent mentioned and, repress and retrieve the VIPs. If something is amiss, then report back to your agent with the details. Uh, add waypoint. And if we complete the mission within the next 4 hours and 22 minutes, we get 164,000 ISK. Excellent. Okay, hurry up, will you? Close. Let's minimise this as well. I think we've got everything we need. Let's just check. Ship hanger. Or... Can I implant this yet? This is my... Uh ocular filter. I wonder if I trained... Yes? Okay, yeah, no, I haven't trained up for that yet. Never mind. Okay, well, we've got everything I think we're going to need on board. Oh, I can take these bits of scrap metal off. Give me the hobgoblin back, thank you. Right, let's go. Undock. We're going to finish up this arc today, I hope, because at the end of it we get our Tristan, so and that's what I'm after. So let's do this. Zoom out! Right. So much stuff on screen, look at all this like... Oh, they're gone now. But... There's a lot going on around the uh, outside of that space station. So we're just here to pick up VIPs and if anything's amiss, we've got to take them out. I detect no life signs within the habitation module and the communication services in the adjacent security tower seem to be down. I suggest approaching Le Fleur Inn to have a better look. Le Fleur! That's the flower in French. Its hull appears to be damaged. A cloud of radioactive glass is flowing through the cracks and filling the void surrounding the structure. The corpses floating around the inn are most likely of people who were ejected through the airlock. Make sure you have a large collidable structure under the entity group selected in the overview setting so you can easily find the structure I pointed out. So they want me to find the La Fleur Inn. Let's have a look. There it is. Yeah, I only know that because one of my uh, friend's daughters is called Fleur. So there's a bit of random knowledge for you. That's how. That's probably all the French I know. That and Gemapel, Gemapel Nux. That's it. That's all the French I know. Why are we approaching this thing? It's clearly bad. Yeah, why is it attacking me? Oh my god, did you see the amount of damage it's just done? Get out of there. Oh, it's done. Objective's complete. So obviously we just needed to... Uh, oh shit, we need to get out of here. Yeah, look what just turned up in the system, Corelli guards and that. If I'd have been a bit more prepared and hadn't taken loads of damage off the Fleur in, I probably would have got into a fight with them. And in fact, I almost want to just get the ship repaired, turn around and go fight them again, to be honest with you. But if that's the mission, I'll take it. Got no reason to go back and fight and we know what's happened to the inn. Requested. Now I Docking think we're going to find out the storyline side of things. Let's close that. Complete mission, right. 
You found only corpses, you say? Oh, this will not sit well with Guru and investment. N not at all. Damn. Okay, so we did our mission within uh, 4 hours and 18 minutes. Managed to get 164,000 isks. So if we look at our wallet. Doing quite well. We're, we're sitting on a million isk, which is always a good thing. So we've got that. Bear that in mind now. So we're going to request the final mission. Oh no, this is 9 of 10 and then the next one's 10 of 10. We've come across a narcotics ring related to all of this Serpentis crap that's been going on, which explains where all the funding is coming from. These scum are smuggling illegal drugs into the Federation and profiting as they ruin other people's lives. It needs to be dealt with. Make your way to the narcotics warehouse, Destinilosis. Be ready for a fight. Our scouts reported some hostiles on patrol around there. Once you find the warehouse, destroy it and then get the hell out. Okay. Ship restrictions, blah, blah, blah. Right, yeah, let's do it. Let's go. I feel like I need to blow my nose, but I'm going to put it off for a couple of minutes. Right, on dock. Did get to the end of the episode and I'm going to sound like this. Right, let's go do this. Oh, I didn't repair! Oh, idiot! Idiot! How much have I lost? 86%. We're turning around. We're redocking. Sorry, guys! I forgot I took damage on the last mission. That doesn't seem to be a kick-out station, like you, you've you got, you can turn around and redock straight away. Repair all, yeah, yeah, 968 isk worth of damage, get out of here. Alright, undock. Such an idiot man, I should have just remembered. Alright, and we're not going to walk straight onto this location, we're going to walk like a thousand, uh, encounter dead space. Ah, uh, can we not not walk to like oh sod it? I was gonna try and get a bit of range between me and it so I could sort of an analyze the situation, but it's all right. Aha, uh -huh. so you can see there I've just uh I've just managed to group up my drones. Uh, thanks to DR for mentioning that and reminding me that you could do that. Right. Let's kill some Serpentis. Space, pack lead, okay. Engage target. And we can put the pressure on him with the rail gun. Another thing DR told me was not to go for, um... I was considering going, like, blaster and long range. But he said just go one or the other, don't go both. Like, you got a really pure build, if that makes sense. Where is this guy? Oh no, too far away. This one. Alright. Go get him, and then I... We'll engage this one just to be irritating. Hey, I killed someone. Excellent. Right. Guys, return an orbit. We've got to go down an acceleration gate. So before we do, I want to get these wrecks. Oh, and we've got more coming in on the system. Excellent. I'm pretty sure that gate just went up. Continue towards the salvage, but... Uh, just be careful. I still want to try and salvage as much as I can, but at the same time, I've got to... Uh, got to fight, haven't I? Yeah, look at all that damage that I've just literally done. Two shots, man. That's excellent. Nice work, drones. I don't see anyone else jumping into the system, which is nice. 
Maybe we can just get these wrecks done. Oh, metal scraps. Excellent. Right. Pack lead return and orbit. Excellent. Alright, let's just go after these ones. And then we'll go for the acceleration gate. Is the, uh, those wrecks closer to the acceleration gate? They are. So we can go pick up this, uh, this one down here if we fly around this rock. Yeah, you'll get it. You'll get it. Yeah, we'll go pick up these guys first, and then we'll go back over there, and then we'll go up to the gate. Okay, excellent. Bit awkward sometimes with the, uh, what's the word? It's like the clipping, I guess. The clipping of rocks and things like that. Um, I think the ship sees it as a bit bigger than it actually is. And we might bounce off something in a minute, just because it's... Why does this wheel keep opening? Is that... How am I doing that? I don't know. Okay, never mind. I don't know what the wheel does anyway. Oh, is it... If you press an... Oh, I get you. It's like a quick select wheel. So if you press an old left button on... Uh... Oh, this is excellent. And he had an acolyte one. Yes, please. I love salvaging drones, it's amazing, it means I'm literally playing, um, oh, and some armour, it means I'm literally, I'm not paying anything for drones as long as I keep finding them, right, so we want to go back up to the acceleration gate, which is there, but we also want these items down here, but to get to them, we're going to go back over this rock, we're not going to go through it, thank you for your acolyte ones, let's have a look at these, Attributes. Uh, max lock targets A. I don't think that's going to come into effect. Not until I've learned how to lock 8 targets. Anyway, armor hit points 120. That's always nice. Um, rate of fire, 4 per sec... Oh, 1 per second. 1 per, f one per 4 seconds. Alright, get down there. And that one needs five. All right, excellent. Shield capacity forty. It's not that strong, but it's got one hundred and sixty-eight structural hit points. So it's not terrible. I still prefer the um, the warriors that I've got. I don't know. We could throw some acolytes in there. The nice thing is about level 1 drones is they all pretty much weigh the same as far as I can remember, so you can have any combination of whatever ones you want. Get down there. I'm going to try and not use this wheel, although the wheel is cool. If you click a, if you click and hold left button on a target, you can uh, just choose open cargo, orbit, you can add the location, you can target it, you can approach it, or you can show the info. So it's going to go open cargo. It's a cool feature, but sometimes I find it throws me off, like when I'm just trying to do stuff, like look around the ship, and I've accidentally clicked, so it's like from here. So I want to just look around the ship. I'm clicking on... Oh, another Acolyte. Excellent. I'm, I'm sort of clicking on him there to turn the camera, and sometimes it'll pick up on... Like there, you just see I double-click this to turn my ship, and it's uh, open the wheel. Whoa, fly through that. Iron charge S. So this is excellent. What we've done is we've actually picked up two acolyte ones, and if they're packaged, yeah, we can put them on top of each other. All right, and then this this guy over here. Are you the last one? You are. We've got a light gun and some metal scraps. Excellent. Can we put them on top of each other? We can. All right, drones. Return to drone bay. Go by cold. Acceleration gate, let's go. Let's do this. Literally here for one reason and one reason only. We've got to destroy... Um, what one are we doing? Narcotics warehouse. Narcotic smuggling. Oh, I'm being locked on too. Well, let's just do this quickly then. Launch the drones. Fly in the opposite direction, please. Thank you. 
And then engage the targets, all the targets, while I look at my journal and decide what it is we're doing here. Not got to go smuggling. Uh, make your way to the narcotics warehouse pointed out to you by your agent and be ready for a fight. Scouts will report some hostiles on patrol there. Once you find the warehouse, destroy it and get out. Okay, so that is like, destroy the warehouse is the ultimate goal. Okay, so if we get that, get into orbit near it. Oh, guys, you've got to, you've got to pick up the pace on uh, dealing with these guys. Is he going to be a trigger, though? If we take him out, is the, is the rest of them just going to turn up? Yep, there they are. Okay. Lock. Lock. And... Engage. There you go. Right. I'm going to turn, but I'm going to glance him with my railgun. 16 kilometers should be the average, the uh, ultimate distance. Hey, we got one. Excellent. Right, now this guy. Get that Corelli scout now. Narcotica. Narcotics war warehouse. Excellent. So I know I'm only managing two targets, but once that guy gets destroyed, but he didn't because he healed, so we're going to just put the pressure on him with the railgun. Hey, there you go. Right. I want this Narcotica Warehouse. Narcotics Warehouse. And I'm just going to tell my drones to engage it. While I fly down here. Look at these guys. They are literally turning up all over the place just to uh, deal me some damage. Hopefully I can take the warehouse down and just leave. I think the, the with buildings in space they've got like one really high one and then the middle one is like quick to destroy. And then the bottom one is is quick to destroy as well. So I think shields are the only thing we've really got to worry about here. Let's swing back round. I don't think they're taking any damage, which is nice. I said swing back round. I am the captain of this ship. You will do as I as I say. Not got to go smuggling. Come on, come on. Come on, guys. I just want to get them back in my drone bay and get out of here, to be honest with you. We could probably take on this guy. But we don't want to, though. We just want to do this and get out, surely. I am taking damage, but it's fine. It's absolutely fine. Come on, guys. Come on. There you go. Come on. Come on, just one more shot and you should have it, guys. Come on. Yeah! Return to Drone Bay. Excellent work, guys. Oh, God, there's a cargo container there. If we go for that, it's probably full of drugs and stuff that we would have trouble transporting between systems, so I'm... I would like to go for it, but I'm not going to. We're just going to go to the Asian home base. There's far too many enemies in this system now. Those two there, and then you've got another three over there, I think. Or you've got them three there, and then you've got another three elsewhere, so... We'll just leave before they start warp scrambling me and all that sort of crazy shit. Pardon me. What's the beeping? Oh, yeah, we've got this weird... non capsuleer log-off timer! Oh, were we followed by a scout? Docking permission requested. I think we were followed back by one of the scouts. Docking requested. I don't know what he's hoping to do, because he's now a red... Red Cross in a, in a world full of capsuleers, so good luck with that. Oh, uh, the following objectives must be completed to finish the mission. Destroy the Narcotica Warehouse. Yep, done. Complete mission. Excellent work, Destiny Oasis. Those smugglers were funding all sorts of illegal activities for their Serpentis friends. Yes, they were. Request mission, but don't accept it. Green Investment Bank isn't happy, and neither am I. It's time to put an end to this wolf. We're willing to reward you handsomely if you take this on. Now, Wolf is heavily guarded by his cohorts. It seems that a number of Serpentas have flocked to his banner. 
because of his no notoriety, so you'll likely need to fight your way through a few of them before getting to him. I'm just glad it isn't the Kaldari we're dealing with, although I'm sure you'll get a taste of them soon enough. A few pirates are easier fare than can Kaldari naval ships, I can tell you. We got our Tristran. Look at it, isn't it amazing? Oh yeah, Tristran, you are amazing. Look, right, all the songs, they can't all be amazing. Right, sharpshooter, and we get 236,000 isk. Find Wolf and take him out. Okay, what I'm going to do is I am going to go to my ship. And I am going to add these acolytes to the drone bay. Alright, acolytes. There you go. And like I said, they, uh, let's repackage all these. Can we stack them? Oh, they won't stack. The sadness arises within me. Um, like I said, the Acolytes, the Warriors, the Hobgoblins, and the other guys, I can't remember who they are, but they take up an equal amount of uh, space with level 1 drones, so you can have any sort of variation you want. So what I might do is go Warrior, Acolyte, Hobgoblin, just to keep it various. Because they each deal different types of damage, so one of them will deal Kinetic, one of them will deal Thermal, and uh, you, you, it's probably best to work out who you're going up against just so you can get the best combination, but really, you just hit them with everything you got and swap out drones that get destroyed. Talking of swapping out drones, we've got all these in here now, so if we... Oh, you've got to move them to the item hangar to repackage them, which is a bit annoying. Makes sense, I suppose. You wouldn't want to repackage them in the back of your ship, but... Alright, and then back to the drone bay. Oh, yeah, no, 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 my bad. I wanted to put them in my uh, my actual ship. And then stack on you. And then these two weapons we should put in the item hanger. Although, let's have a look at this 100mm reinforced nanofibre plate. Got a fit in. What have we got down here? Reinforced steel plates. Now look at defense is 1,599 HP. If we take this out, it goes down to 1,300. We put that on, it goes up to 1,623. What happens if we take the titanium plate off and replace it with the steel again? Yeah. Okay, so the best mixture we can go for out of these selected is titanium and nanofiber. Excellent. So we can get rid of that if we want. I don't really want a stasis web of fire, I don't really see the point. I, mm, minus 35% to thermal damage is is pretty good, if I do say so myself, so we might keep that. Uh, 69 HP repair per 5.4 seconds, I feel like that could probably save me in a scrap. Talking of scrap, let's get rid of these metal ones. Uh, sell this item I guess. Yeah, why not? Three grand. Just a drop in the ocean. Uh, stasis web of fire. Overdrive injector. I don't really want to add one of these, I don't think. Pardon me. So we're going to sell this. Not at 60% below the reasonable average, though. Okay. And what have we got up here? This needs reloading. Antimatter. Okay. So let's do you. And that one hasn't been fired, so that's fine. Oh, I've got more metal scraps there, excellent. So, item hanger. Uranium charge, iron charge. Sell the scrap metal. Excellent. Right. Put online. Ah, oh, it's not going to let me. Okay, no worries. Right, accept. And this is in the next system over, so let's go. Now, be careful out there, you hear me? Excellent. Right, undock. Let's do this, we've got two jumps to go until we're in the system that we want to be in. And hopefully, put one of the acolytes in there. Oh, we'll put two of them in there. Ah, uh, but really we don't want to, we want to... How do we split the pack? I'm just going to quickly launch them, and then 
pull this one back, so return to drone bay. Acolyte one, go back up there, and then return to drone bay. Oh my god, camera angle, please. A sickness arises within me. Right, Acolyte one, Hobgoblin one, Warrior one, Impact Lead, excellent. And then you got drones in bay up there. We'll open Pack Lead. And. Where are we going? Loose? Is that where our next. Stargate's loose, excellent. Uh, jump. <coughs> Please excuse me. People are still leaving cargo containers outside. Uh, Space stations. I don't know what this all. I don't know what that's all about. I think it's basically if, if I. I don't know if this is true, but one of the old cores I used to be around in is to say if you uh, went into those cargo containers, people would get the right to shoot you. So I don't know. You might have to check that out, and I will look into it. And if that isn't the case, I might just start looking through all those cargo containers to see what people are giving away. Right. Okay, the next section we want to go into is you can baron. So we'll jump. You you can baron. I don't know the names. I don't know how to say the names. Well, all the names in my universe are quite easy to understand, like oh, chaos, Yulth. Ruel was probably the hardest one. Here we go. Right, now we should be in the mission section of space now. So all we've got to do is warp to it within the system. Agent missions, encounter in dead space. Excellent. Warp to location. Actually, where are the stations in this? Okay. Alright, I just want to know that we've got stations to jump to should the need arise. Plenty of police in this area as well, loads of Concord. As I exited the gate then, which is nice to know that they're, they're around. Alright, I'm going to zoom out because I want a good view of this. Okay, we're going to have to use the jump gate and it doesn't look like there's any... Uh, Doesn't look like there's any people here, so we'll just use this. Warp drive active. It's always good to check so you know where you whether or not you've got to deploy drones. If there's nothing in the area, there's no point deploying drones. But if you jump in and there's stuff in the area, deploy, deploy, deploy. So we want to deploy, deploy, deploy. Launch all the drones. And you see these guys over here, Serpentis Rookie. And Serpentis Rookie. And we get that last one. Oh god, okay, right. What we want to do is go that way and engage target and put that up. Oh god, do I really have to activate the uh, dissipation field? That's kind of loose. Sod it. Just in case they start attacking me, you know? Right, that's one down. Serpentis Rookie, attack. Yeah, right now these guys over here, these are also rookies, so that doesn't really matter. I'm waiting for them to bring out the heavy guns, to be honest with you. Right, get this guy, engage. And then I will lock on to these guys. Engage. Yeah, engage. Know how drone targeting works. I really wish I could target more than just two. I remember being able to target three on my old player. So uh, it's obviously a skill you can learn. I think it is just targeting skill. There you go, engage. None of my drones have taken any damage. I haven't taken any damage. This is excellent. This is really excellent. He's dead. Right, okay. And there are two down here. Corelli agent. Okay, so get a lock on and then just start shooting at this guy, please. There you go. Right, and then with you. 
then we're gonna not fly to avoid, but we are gonna take a a different path to what they're expecting, I guess. Curly agent, and then this guy over here, he he's gonna get it as well. But not from that. My ship's taken a few hits, but it's nothing nothing drastic. In fact, I think. Can we do that? Oh, actually, there's no point really, is there? It's just, uh... If you guys could engage that target, that'd be great. There you go. So much salvage. So much salvage. And that's probably going to trigger a few more to jump into the system. No? Are we good? We're good. Excellent. Right. I want this guy's uh, loot. Uh, okay, we can turn that off now. I want to see if this... This does armor. That's my shield. So I should, uh, I should wait until my middle one is going down before I start activating armor repair. Okay. Right. Get in close. Bloody miles away, look at this. And we'll get these guys to return an orbit. Please stop locking onto them camera, it freaks me out. Alright. We're gonna have to go across this uh this gate that's over here, the acceleration gate. But that's fine. Gives my uh picking up all this salvage gives my uh, ship shield storm to heal as well which is nice and we'll go out there and get all that loot as well hopefully there'll be more drones although I'm feeling a bit greedy now asking for all these drones it's like oh I just blew you, all your guys up now give me give me stuff even though you gave me stuff on the last section it's not how the world works I'm afraid right where's the next wreck Corelli agent congratulations you have won the prize and then Serpentis Rookie, Serpentis Rookie. Okay, excellent. Yeah, it's just it's close enough to the gate, isn't it? <coughs> Nothing found. Uh, Serpentis Rookie. It's probably the slowest part of this uh, this Let's Play is going from ship to ship, trying to loot them all. <laughs> God, rock in the way there, guy. Be careful of that. Um, yeah, no, the longest thing is probably transferring from system to system and uh, the looting. But I suppose you've you've really got to do the looting if you want to uh, if you want to get all the fun stuff. Uh, free drones, man. I can never turn down free drones. Oh, no, 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 that one, yeah, and then that one, getting a bit ahead of myself, excellent, excellent, and then go for that one, and then we'll go for the acceleration gate, yeah, because there's no more wrecks left, excellent, in that case, we will also bring all the drones back, so return to drone bay, oh, some iridium charge S, excellent, We'll lock that up. Are all my drones back in the bay? They are. Close out that window and... How's my shield looking? 93%. Once it gets up to 95, I'll jump. Just to be sure. Hello, 95. No? No? Hey, 95. Okay, let's go. Warp drive active. Let's do this. Let's do it to it. Oh, last mission. We're going to get our Tristran. It's going to be amazing. It's uh, another acceleration gate. So we know we've probably got a fight on our hands in this section. Oh my god, what is that? Broken particle acceleration structure. 
It's the Hadron Collider for your face. And because I've been distracted, these guys are coming up on me. Oh my god, you are going to get locked onto, my friend. Don't fly that way, fly that way. Gauge. And then this guy. Go that way. Oh, you're just in range, mate, of my rail gun. So enjoy this. Okay, fly back with jeez. There is a lot of stuff. Yeah, suck it maggots. Fly back that way. I'm loving this particle collider thing. This is awesome. The random sort of stuff you find in space, eh? Ten thousand meters. Probably not the best to start dropping the railgun on him, but it's worked, so I'm, I can't really complain about that. Yeah, just go straight in. I want to move out of the way. Corelli Spy. Corelli Spy. Excellent. There you go. Please be careful of the massive uh, particle acceleration structure, guys. No telling what it'll do to us. I'm flying pretty close to them. Where are they coming from? That's the other thing you need to be concerned about, is where do they keep spawning into the system? Because if I go down here, kill this guy, and it triggers, and like four of them drop them, jump into my location where I've just killed them, then uh, that doesn't work out well for us. In fact, why have I not got my thermals on? There you go. Corelli Spire, okay. And then we'll deactivate that. Return an orbit. Go up that way until we can tell what's going on in the system. I think we should be cool. Oh no, we've still got two more. So take him and him. And engage. I want to go in the opposite direction to them, really. Where are they? I don't even know where they are. Oh, there they are. Okay. Uh, we've got the range on him, so let's fire the rail guns, do it. Do it, do it, do it. <coughs> so this mission is quite a stretch, man. Like, it's quite difficult to do. It feels like a sort of in-space boss fight, if you know what I mean. You've got to fight through all the minions and then you get to the main bloke. Okay, can we return and orbit him? In fact, we might just be able to get away with being cheeky about this, to be honest with you. Stop firing that railgun, it's doing no good whatsoever. Oh, so much loot as well. There you go. Should be all she wrote. Yeah, it looks like it. Okay. Let's have a look at what these guys have got for loot. And turn off the thermal resistance. Nothing found. Uh, return an orbit, yep. Yeah. Oh my god, I don't want to fly too big to this superstructure because I'll get caught on it. That's crazy though. It's so crazy. Nothing found, eh? Oh no! No! Downtime will begin in an hour! 
No. All right, what we're going to do is we are going to return these drones to bay. And we're going to go through this uh, final acceleration gate. I know there's a lot of loot in the area that we should pick up, but I don't want to fight against downtime again. And I still want to get my bonus of like 160 whatever the fuck it is. Isk. So we're going to do it. Come on. Let's go find Wolf and make this happen. There it is. Wolf stasis. I've located your target in this area. He's not in fact inside the stolen Navy ship. I defect his life signs inside the Stasis Web of Fire Tower attached to this outpost. It's currently causing a major slowdown in our velocity. That's fine. Release all the drones, please. Right, there we go. Um, I give a fuck about Wolf Stasis Tower for now. We need to get rid of the little minions. Put the Stasis Web of Fire up. Or well, not the Web of Fire, but the other one. Right, get in there. There you go. In fact, I could probably take this thing out at range if I really wanted to. Oh my god, please stop slowing me down. 98 meters per second. Jesus, my usual speed something like a uh, 500 summit. Oh my god, we are getting owned out here though, eh? Gonna jump out. So, stations, we'll just go to this one, dock. Warp drive. I'm going to get repaired and then I'm going to come back into this section. So we've got to go through all three of those warp lanes again and then we'll uh, we'll jump back in. But we know where Wolf is now and if we really wanted to, we could just aim for him. But we need to go get repairs. We're in Mimitar controlled space? Requested. Maybe, Docking possibly. Repair shop! Thank you, repair the item. Repair all, yes, yes, yes. Okay, so that's everything. What the fuck is this guy? Look at this guy! Be gone, scum! Oh my god, yeah, alright. Right. right. Got one million isk. Excellent. <sighs> if you're taking heavy damage to your arm, or warp out immediately. Then either dock at a nearby station and pay the repair ship there, repair shop, repair shop there to fix your ship, or while I'm docked, use an armor repair until you're ready to fight back in the fight. Better safe than have to pay for a new ship and fittings. So the game sort of does encourage that, and it's 236 if we do this quickly. So <sighs> let's get back out there. I've now got to go through three bloody warp gates to get back to where I was, so coming away from this isn't the best option, I don't think. <sighs> okay, warp to location. I really want to do this before uh, downtime starts. Oh no. Two hobgoblins, I'm guessing. We'll try that. Right, acceleration gate. Warp drive active. Go, go, go! And then we got to do it again. Go, go, go! You can't do it while you're uh, coming out of warp of another section. Like, you can't just jump from acceleration gate to acceleration gate. You do need to... Slow down a bit and uh, come out of warp down the bottom here. The stace, the Webifier Tower that he's sitting on is probably the most annoying. Reload all. Thank you. Yeah, the fact that he's sitting on a, uh, a slowdown beacon basically is uh, kind of annoying. Acceleration gate. Warp drive active. And the annoying thing with these gates is they st they dump you out right like on top of what you're trying to do. Oh fuck! You know what I should have done? I should have. Okay. 
on one out. Go up there. Before you can get Stasis Weber fired. Just go up. <laughs> yes, it's working. Oh, he's got me, but it's all good. We are kicking his ass with drones. And because he can't move. Oh, God, I keep forgetting to put the thermal uh, doodad on. There goes the stolen Navy ship. He is coming closer, but that's fine because we're dealing with Wolf. And because Wolf can't move, I can get into range of him better. So while we're going away from him, yeah, that's fair enough. But my railgun can only sort of shoot at 16 kilometers range. So the further away from him we get, the more chance we've got of hitting him, which is nice. We also want to get rid of these stolen Navy ships and this Corelli agent as well. So, But to do this, I need to get rid of this Weber fire, basically. Which is the start. Yep, keep firing. Keep firing. It doesn't matter. Just keep going. Come on. Six from the stolen Navy ship. Come on. Just keep going up. Why are they not attacking that anymore? Engage, guys. Come on. Come on, come on. This has got to be final hits now. Come on. Come on. This guy on the left here, he's following me, man. He's locked onto me like nobody's business. Yeah, okay, right. Wolf has made an appearance. Let's see if we can't get rid of these other two ships first, though. No, go up, you dick. <laughs> Right, they're taking on this guy, aren't they? So we'll give him a little bit of backup with that. Because he's 11 kilometres away, and while it's not within like the sort of 16 maximum, there's always a chance I can get a nice little cheeky hit on him. And now with this stolen Navy ship, I don't really want to do it because it's part of the old Navy, but uh, we haven't really got much choice in the matter, I don't think. Like, there's no way to recapture the ship and give it back to the Navy, I don't think. But then you've got to think, how the hell did the guys here manage to get hold of hold of some dude's ship, you know? How did they manage to steal it off the Navy? Oh, I've podded him. I was expecting a fight. Well, well, Mr. Wolf. The tables have turned. My good friend. We've potted him. So, not in targeting range. As soon as he's in target range, we're just going to kill him and his pod to stop him from doing any of this shit ever again. It's a shame we can't capture him. That'd be really cool. Right, my drones, engage the target. And while we're doing this, we could do a bit of looting. Little scraps, excellent. Go down to this one. I think they're going to have a lot of trouble hitting him because he's so small. I think that's the thing with pods, like they're they're difficult to hit. Corelli agent, yeah, go go for that guy. There we go. Wolf is dead. Pirate capsule, excellent. Oh, is that a mission goal? Oh, okay. Oh, mission generic small wreck. Okay, excellent. Where am I going? I'm going for this one, eh? No, 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 no. That one. You guys can return an orbit. Nothing found. Alright, let's go for this pirate capsule. Maybe we'll get wolf's dog tags or something like that, you know? That'd be kind of cool. Come on, the me. No? Oh. 
Frozen corpse. Do we want to pick him up? I don't think we can, can we? And cargo container. Antibiotics, dairy products, water. We'll take all that, even though I'm not sure if it's narcotics or not. Narcotica smuggling. Uh, take all that. And then we'll do this Corelli agent wreck, and then we'll leave the system. Oh, man, we killed Wolf. Excellent. Right, return to Drone Bay. Da 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 dun da da dun 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 what I'm going to do is I'm going to loot this last guy and then I'm going to make my travel all the way back to the uh, agent location. Uh, so you guys don't have to watch me uh, travelling between worlds. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to close that, close that. I don't think I put anything in the station nearby. I did not. Excellent. Let's just make sure that the mission is completed. Yep, done, done. Okay, right. This is it, guys. I will catch you back up when we get back to the station. See you soon. Okay, so we're back in Clenenon or Clenililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililililil